What is going on, y'all? TMB Outdoors here. Just gonna drill a few holes. Just got to the lake, pretty much already set up. I uh, drove on on the shore, so I didn't have to walk so far. I was here yesterday. Caught a few walleye. Uh, see if I can ca catch into a few more today. Maybe some perch, some jumbos. There's a couple around here. Last year I caught a few. But yeah, I'm gonna get popping some holes here. Get a tip up out and uh, switch back and forth with my rods on uh, jumbo perch and with some walleye. So get a hole drill here. First hole drilled. Let the fishing begin. What is going on, folks? So, set up for today. Uh, we got an aqua boo camera that we'll have set up for you guys. And I think I'm going to try first frostbite. Tantrum. Get a better look here. This is the glow craw. Gonna give that a shot right off the bat. And if that doesn't work, I'm gonna switch right back to what I was using yesterday. Uh, I was just using my light rod here with a uh, little tungsten and a sliver of a uh, minnow on it. I'll be fishing one rod in the shack and one tip up with a with just a single just one treble and a minnow on it. See see what happens with that. But yeah, let's see here. Oh big walleye on the camera. Huge. Huge walleye. I can't see where my hook is. I didn't even get the camera set up. Like I just came in as soon as I dropped this hook down. I can't even. spooked him I can see yeah. let's see here get this camera set up darn I definitely spooked him I should have had the camera set up first there it is okay well that was exciting <laughs> Nice walleye come in right off the bat. And I spooked him though because I couldn't see what was going on. Camera wasn't set up on him. Let's just give it a few minutes here and see what happens. Not a huge, huge walleye. I was excited, but probably might break 20. It's like a pretty decent one. Darn. Can't be far.
Yeah, I might have might have spooked him. I didn't have the camera set up and uh, I saw him swim by the camera towards where my hook is because I couldn't see it and I was jigging and jigging, tapping it on spot and then I saw a big cloud of mud. So I'm pretty sure, pretty sure I spooked him. Let's, let's keep you guys on here and let's see let's see what it does if I drop down a tungsten tipped with a minnow. Tip whoops down. And a lovely morning so far. That was awesome. <laughs> first second I dropped the hook down alright so yeah usually what I like to do a lot is I like using the end of the tail just with a little bit of meat it's really got some like cool fluttery action because of the tail and then I like to hook it like right where the meat is at the end of the tail or like the beginning of the tail and uh, it seems to really work well and it stays on the hook really well you can use it for like many catches depending how aggressive the fish are but yeah let's let's give this a shot sun is sun is out they should see this really well Got some really nice jumbo perch here too. I've caught in a couple nice ones. Seen some really, really, really big ones in this lake. In this spot, I've seen quite a few. But yeah, we're uh, we're just fishing on a nice little uh, mud flat here. It does really slow, slow, gradual drop into the basin. And I seem to have really good luck fishing in this spot. They seem to cruise. So where was that? That fish was coming from. That fish came roughly cruising the edge of this, or this cruising this flat from deeper water, I would like to say. But they come from all over. They they come from the shallower end of this flat to deeper end of this flat. It seems to be just uh, a hot spot cruising fish all day.
put you guys on the camera so you guys can see what's going on. Boom. Just trying to get the camera set up there and a pike come in to take a look at the tungsten. Technical difficulties. <laughs> okay, that's down. Switch the angle here. Again, got the camera adjusted and uh, looking good. So yeah, we just just missed a pike that come in. Maybe you'll go for that that tipped tipped minnow tip up. <coughs> hmm. But yeah, I'm hoping to see that walleye come back. got on the tungsten with the tip minnow right now just a little little piece of minnow works great I'll be back with you when we see some fish hey folks oh I can't see got on to some perch here to come by see if I can trick one into biting This one might take. Oh, no, maybe not. They come into the rattle bay. I just, I just switched back up to this because the perch come by. They seem to really, really like those rattle baits. They uh, come in fast. Why they're leaving though? Take a bite. Let's come at it twice now. Oh, come on. Circle around. seen a fish for a while since those perch. And this walleye come in and gives me two looks and he's gone. Come on, hope we come back. I come in. 
sure why they're, oh, there he comes back. Smoke it. Oh, you, you just touched it. Come on. It's a, maybe under 20, maybe a 17, 18 incher. Might be smaller. Come on, right there, right there. Playing with me. So close. I swear I thought he was gonna bite. So close. Come on. Let's see if he comes back. Just in the middle of trying to get some lunch in me. smaller than this. It's just a tungsten. They usually always bite this. John. Chomped it. He got all the trebles in his, in his mouth. This will be a nice keeper, too. Let some light. 
in here. Make it worse. <laughs> Anyways, you can see right there. I just got one hook out. He chomped that. I switched to the white frostbite. Okay, don't hook myself here now. Oh yeah. There we go. Switch to the frostbite clownfish tantrum. Nice little Walter here. I don't think I need to bother to get a measurement. Oh, dunk. I think I'm gonna hold on to this guy for lunch or dinner. <laughs> that was sweet. On, on the aqua blue. Just curling his tail on me. There we go. Nice little walleye. Yeah, I think I'll keep this one. Toss him in the bucket. Alright, let's get that hook back down there. Let's go. <laughs> Buddy Spencer just showed up. You got a tip up. Start. He's at the hole. He's at the hole. No! Fucking Christ! <laughs> was it big? <laughs> no, it was right at the hole. How big was it though? Fucking like the head was this big. <laughs> Holy! All right, folks. Fuck, it was right there. <laughs> So, oh, why is that zoomed in so much? There we go. So yeah, buddy just lost a nice pike, probably above 30 inches maybe, give or take, I didn't get to see. But yeah, we got a, we got a tip up over there. He's got one a lot closer, it spooled him. We had a few show up on the camera, nothing else. Oh, the camera's fogging up too. Anyways, uh, we'll get back to fishing. And Bring you along and get another one. Alright, folks, we got a pike on the camera. Smaller one? Uh, it's a, yeah, a smaller side, but not huge. Maybe just under 30, like a 26 inch pike, maybe. He just swam right by my hook. a little bit. Alright. Just had a pike, a perch, and a walleye on the cam. Let's see if I can get something to come back. That was so close, man. Like he came up, followed it up. My little tungsten, I got just got that tungsten on. 
It was a nice walleye too, another keeper. Is this a tiny little hook? It's just a little tungsten, yeah. What? I hope he comes back for another. It's a good sign, all the fish are, the fish are moving. How he spooked. Like he was gonna bite it. Huh? All your bites were on minnows today? Uh well that one the only one I got was on that frostbite tantrum. Oh okay. And I didn't have any bait on that one. But this one, uh like last night, last evening I caught five to back to back yeah. and uh, it was all on a tungsten tipped with a tiny little piece of the tail and then I did catch one when it got really dark with the tantrum again with a little bit of uh, fish on a minnow something to come back. Spencer got another tip up. I'm coming. Oh. Look at that thing. Just mangled. Oh. <laughs> Did you see him? No. No? Gosh darn that that's the lucky tip up for the day. <laughs> Mine. Oh. Where is mine? Over there. Nothing. Huh. <laughs> Darn it. <laughs> Two walleye, bro. Oh. I moved I moved the hook weirdly because I was trying to reach for the camera to start recording. Spook? Yeah, they both they both took off. They'll come back. It's still early. They're just they're just getting getting going around the place. Like they're not crazy aggressive, but they'll they'll start getting getting aggressive as it gets darker. Darn! Literally did the same thing as the last one. Came right up to my hook. And it looked like he touched it, but... Anytime now. Hey, you just talking. Hey, folks. Uh, we're done fishing for the day. Uh, we got into a few more tip-ups. Uh, Spencer lost a couple. What do you got to say about that, Spencer? Fuck it. Oh, fuck. I got to give my tip-up still. <laughs> but yeah, we're, we're just going to head out here. Uh, we saw a few more walleye. I uh, was about to catch into a few more, but they didn't want to commit and bite. So uh, we'll see you guys back in another video. And good luck fishing, y'all. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and hit the fucking notification icon. <laughs>